Tell them tell them where you at. Are we in New York City? They see me? Like, how far is it on my face? Oh, they can see you. Yes. But you gotta extend your hand. But you gotta hold the camera, babe. Don't drop it. it can I, like, come on? Yeah. <laughs> no. Not Ava, y'all. Oh, yeah, clean on it. Yeah. Clean the shark. What you gotta say? How you feel about being in New York? I'm going to see my granddad. That's good. I'm here with a friend of mine, y'all. <laughs> How you feel about flying out to New York to see your girlfriend? It's, uh, it's been alright so me. far. It's been alright so far. I get to meet the family. How you feel about meeting the family, though? I'm ready. You ready? Head to the Best Buy. Is she trying to tell me how to? You don't know how to vlog. And get the, uh, the one that left the tripod. She want to go in here and get some edge control. Cause ain't no, ain't no regular stuff gonna uh, hold them edges down. So we going to check in Best Buy for some edge control for her. What's up y'all? So um welcome back to my channel. Okay, this is uh, welcome back to my channel. Why are you talking like you in a fucking box? Shut up, let me let me she introduce from New York. Let me introduce you. Take this off. Okay, what's up y'all? So as you can see I have my boyfriend. <laughs> my boyfriend here. And we went to the city and we got Liddy. So you know we didn't get Liddy yet. But tonight we're gonna get Liddy. He's gonna meet my family. And yeah, tomorrow we're driving to Maryland and he's gonna meet my mom and my sisters and all of them. And yeah. So we're just gonna vlog. So make sure you like, comment, subscribe. I know about the YouTube. Anyways, y'all. Um, I know about the YouTube. Yeah, so we're gonna vlog. This is the beginning of the vlog. Y'all see the hair? Give me very much strawberry shortcake. Give me a kiss. Yeah, she asked for kisses every two minutes. Bro, cause he don't be wanting to give me kisses. Why she'll you she'll like not that? give me kisses when her lips are okay, but she'll wait till she put on lip gloss, Vaseline Nigga, on top lie. of lip gloss. That's a lie. Cause when my lips are dry, I still kiss. And then when they give me kisses. kisses, like what are you talking about? Well, they don't make sense. Right now. You wanna flood my lips cause you flood your lips? No sir. Anyway. Anyways. Bye. Bye y'all. Bye. What's up y'all? So right now right now we are walking to the restaurant. And I forgot to vlog earlier, but basically more of the story is he met my family. How'd you feel about that? Here great. And they loved him, and I met his grandfather, we see his grandfather, and we came back to the city. I got ready, we both got ready, and now we're going to dinner, so. Yeah, I'm going to try to vlog what I can, but I'm not good at vlogging, y'all know this, so. You don't need to be a nerd if you were me, Charlie. Make up your mind. Y'all, so we walk into the museum and this is what we're looking at right now. It's 
Plates combo with fries. I got a honey old bay wing combo with fries. So she got her food and I got mine. So don't reach over so my fucking plate. Say, don't don't reach food. over here on my plate. Cause you can have a whole last meal. Won't start me on shit until I start eating my shit. So how we met, bro? Yeah, you should start cause you want to see me. I was following her for like a couple months. You know, she was posting quotes and shit, like memes, like niggas this, niggas that. It oh, wasn't when you do that, it. POV of this. Oh, okay. It was she going through content. the same shit I was going through, pretty much. Mm -hmm. Following them. See, at the time, she was posting about a nigga she was fucking with. So I was like, okay. You know she talked to somebody, because she just ain't finna put it relatable quote, and she not going through it. Unless you're just trying to get people to relate to her past feelings, but it was something she was going through right then and there. How did you That's know what that? you're not gonna. How did you? Do? You was assuming. Not assuming. Am I right though? Okay, but what you, you was going through right now. Okay. So it died down a little bit. And I said, "Shit, you know, you miss a hundred percent of the shots you don't take. <laughs> you put the messages up here, right?" Anyway, I was just like, shoot, I seen you on TikTok. You know, I ain't trying to see you like a fan or that. Bro, you skipping parts, bro. What? 
What made you shoot your shot when you posted that video? That TikTok video. Oh yeah. I posted a video. I was like, every time I see her on my fucking page, I'm seeing her shaking water and shit. I'll probably put the video up. Yeah, let's put the video in. Yeah, that's how we met. I'm shot, my shot. That first time? She let me on fucking open. You're lying. Instagram, you like my message. Bro, okay. first of all, he posted the first video, and I seen Ignored it. Ignored it. And just I liked just, it. I and just crossed it off because, you know, like, I'm just thinking he like any other nigga type shit. Like, because niggas do that. So I'm just like, okay. But then he posted another video. And you tagged me. You put my pictures in there. We're going to put that video in there. And then I was like, let me, look, let me see who this nigga is. Like, let me look at his face. Whole time, I'm thinking she's like 5'8, 5'9, you know. So, anyway, I look at his page. Mind you, he had came in my TikTok DMs, but I didn't see it till after the fact because nobody texted me TikTok DMs. So, why did you? He was like, I like the way you carry yourself. This, that, <laughs> type shit, type shit. Hey, girl. When was that? That you came in my TikTok DMs. Oh, no. So then, after I looked at his page, I DM'd him, but he already had swiped up on my story with her. Dubbing the fuck out me like And I liked man. it, but he ain't say nothing else. Then I texted him, I said, how tall are you? Cause he really scoping a nigga page out, thinking I'm short as hell. So. I didn't even, you have to ask those questions. But I lied. Yeah, you lied about his height. I said I was what, six foot? No, you said you was like five. Five nine. Yeah, I think he said five nine. I ain't like to be on five seven and a half. So did have me. Mm -mm -mm. Why you like? Cause I knew you were at least five okay, nine. Okay, so imagine if you was like, I'm six foot, and I was like, oh, okay, I'm I'm five six. Then we see each other. Now I'm taller than you. Nigga, you I'm not looking, five six. Okay, but you would have been looking dumb though. Okay, so we link. <laughs> Well, we were talking. We've been talking for a minute now. We've been talking for 11 months now. Mm. We've been talking for a year. Talking We've for been a year. dating. I'm dating for like 11 months. Mm. Obviously, we had to get to know each other. And it's harder over, you know, long distance and shit. Because if y'all didn't know, he lived in Georgia and I live in New York. So. Good. What it taste like? It's sweet? Yeah. Now we're about to do questions. Yeah. We already answered how to drop me, so it says, how do you guys handle the long distance relationship? Like, how you make it work? Oh, well, it's easy for me because I ain't jumping in, you know, everything I see. It still don't attract me. Mm -hmm. Like, you really gotta be different to attract me. Yes. So. It's the same thing with me, for real. Like, you just gotta be patient with your partner. Like, if y'all both wanted to work, if y'all both, like, like, me really serious about this shit, then y'all gonna make it work. You gotta have fast communication. Like, it's harder because y'all can't see each other, but, like, <laughs> just do shit that make it easier. Like, be on FaceTime. And she didn't like me on the phone when we first started talking. I don't like being on the phone, period. I ain't started getting on the phone. So when we first started talking, I was like, bro, this ain't gonna last. Going with the most, because you know how it is when you talk to a girl. A new girl like that. You got intention, some intention, but it don't move no further because she don't check back. Or he don't text back, or one of them start ghosting you. Okay. And, um... Nigga, I've been ghosted before. Me too. Okay then, so where are y'all gonna get So, um, y'all know how that is, bro. Like, it just for that time being, it's not nothing real. It's just like a... Temporary. Yeah. Eventually, I got comfortable being on the phone with him. Yeah, when she first started talking, she, she wasn't talking like this now. She put on that a little ass girl accent. What are you talking about? This and that, this and that. <laughs> what? It's been like a year, a year and a half since I've been on the phone with a girl. Actually, you know, 
It's trying to be out kinked up and shit. I had to learn all over again. He's down the phone to like, but like, probably an hour. Yeah. That first time, it wasn't that long. Cause I didn't want to be on the phone. Like, I didn't like being on the phone. It was something that made me like, continue to put effort and consistency. Like text you every day, text you good morning. Asking how your day was. See, some girl, believe it or not, some girl do not like getting text good morning. I like getting text good morning. I mean, if you my man, obviously. Or if I'm fucking with you, like, heavy. Because, like, imagine you just wake up. Y'all don't talk all day until later. It's like, you're not really interested in me because me, I'll wake up and I'm thinking I'm about him already. Like, went to sleep, think about him, dream about him. Wake up, think about him. Uh, let me try some of those wings. So she got her food and I got mine. So don't reach over my friend. Terrible. No, it's taking me. He might it. Funniest moment together. Uh, <laughs> damn, I gotta think. Yeah, I gotta think too. Mm. <laughs> like, we have funny moments, but like, it's more like we'll have deep conversations about something. Dang! <laughs> Babe, what is it? What is it? I told you. I told you. Right. Mm. Actually, I think the funniest moment was when we was all drunk. Oh, yeah. At the B&B. It was me, my best friend, and him. And we was drunk playing games and shit. Yeah, that was funny. I mean, we thought it was funny. It probably ain't funny if you look back at it. In the moment, bro. Favorite thing about each other? My favorite thing about him is he's focused. He's hardworking, focused, hardworking, and he's funny. Like he has a personality, and he's respectful to me and his family, everybody, pretty much. <laughs> Probably how she cares for folks. You know, she look good, smells good. You know. She's a beautiful individual and things of that nature. <laughs> she feed me. She look out for my family. Like she love me. She really show. The people who I'm connected to, she love them just the same. Like. Will y'all move closer to each other soon? Yes. Yes. Ain't no moving closer. If we get any closer, we might have moved the fuck in with each other. We've been out there to Georgia. But that's the plan. Where would you want to live? Hang in the future if you move. I don't know. We gotta travel and figure out where we wanna be at. Like God will give you a sign when place to live for me. I'm the type of person that don't want to settle for that either. Right. Something that your partner does that annoys you. Bruh, touching my ass. I'm smart. In the middle of the slow, I could be finna pay for something. All up on me touching my ass. <laughs> like, I'm the nigga. I can't help and it. And another though. thing. Be want kisses back to be on kiss. I go back doing what I'm doing. Five seconds later. Hold on, give me another one. Can't show a face. Yeah. Something that annoys me is. He always thinks he's right about everything. No, I don't. Right. <laughs> yeah. Right about what? Everything. I need some of that. No, you should not. Oh, shit, man. He be being an asshole sometimes. And he don't realize it. Don't be intentionally. He be trying to get her tough. She be, she be rolling over to people. Tough. Rolling over and just going into this little ass hole, going in the dark place, what? not talking to nobody. That's how I deal with shit. I just fall back. Uh, 
That ain't healthy. I mean, it may not be, but that's how I cook. You have a ranch. When do you see yourself next year? Next year, I see myself in my own crib, in our crib, making money like 10K a month. Got our business going, got our platform growing. Happy, at peace, wealthy, healthy, and blessed. Period. Ready to be higher. Mm -hmm. Yeah, a little bit more money saved up. Multiple sources of income. I want to make money without working so fucking hard, mm -hmm. bro. That's why I said building our platform. How long you went without taking a shower? Don't lie. Like three, four days. Mm -hmm. I'm being honest though. This had to be recent, cause. You smell like 10 cans of fountain. Nigga, you just said I smell good. Stop lying. Am I probably about a week or two? Exactly. He stinks. I'm a nigga. Thing. So? Fuck? I was in middle school, you know. Go outside, run around, sweat, come back in the house. Then that one, my hat was breaking off it real bad too because I didn't take care of my hat. Mm. Had to be all everywhere. Laying on the floor on the carpet, hair breaking mm -hmm. off. Too much healthy, being grown, laying out all the time at night, playing basketball. You was uh, young? What, playing basketball and nah. staying out all night? Yeah, like staying out and stuff. Shit. Sixth, seventh grade? Oh, no. Not partying. I mean, some party, but if you had a last meal, what would your last meal be? Um. Steak, potatoes, rice. I love me some steak and chips. Or some pot roast, where it's like that tender. Man, last meal, it'll be a hundred of them wings with that old base off. Huh. I told him, y'all. If y'all wondering where we ate at, it's the Magic Best. It's in Maryland, the DMV area. This, this ain't Maryland. This is Maryland. I'm in Baltimore right now. We in Baltimore? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm full of food. Yeah, you see food? Stop! What? That's something that annoys me too. He be chill with his mouth open and he be doing all that extra shit. Like. Try not to break a bracket. Don't want that, but we got the same fucking drink. No, I got more lemonade than mine. What'd you put in my drink? Maybe it's called regular I got. You trying to I got, I got 70% lemonade. All right, go for it, all right, I don't need you no know, more. Take me to that honey oak bay. <laughs> anyway. So. Take me there. Bro, ask a question. Last question. How many kids? Do you want to have? Okay, me honestly speaking, at first I didn't see myself having kids, but honestly, it takes the right person that you meet to like make you want to have kids. And it's just that level of maturity and patience that you be like, okay, I can see myself having kids with this person, and you know, like giving them a future, giving them a household with two parents. You know, you gotta be smart about it. But me, honestly speaking, I would say two. You want like, how many six. like? I want six of them. I'm not pushing six kids, I'm not, I'm not doing that. You <laughs> I'm not doing that. You're not pushing them out? Push two out? Have two seconds for the rest. Shut up, problem. you think it's that easy? We go through I'm postpartum. I'm gonna be right people, there. Bro, you're not the one that's pushing them out. You're not the one that's getting sliced I'm up. I'm holding your hand though. Y'all, please tell him it's not a one-two step. In our connection like this, I want to feel whatever you're feeling, Jay. So, so what, what age are you trying to have him? Oh, we what started age? at 24. So, we're gonna be 22 in December. We got two more years to we prepare. Not, we're not starting at 24, y'all. Wait, eight nine months to have a baby. Okay, I get that, but like we could start at like say some old shit. It's really not old. Don't wait like, till that bones get popping. We gonna start having kids probably around like end of 26, 27, probably beginning of 27, earliest. 
28, 29, and then I'm not having it with you. Well, we can spread it out, obviously, because I'm not about to be sitting down back to back, back to back for nine months straight. So we can have, we could start having kids like 27, nine months, okay. And the 28, and then maybe 29, and then Gucci. Well, that's the end of our video, guys. <laughs> <laughs> Make sure you comment, like, and subscribe. Been trying to start the YouTube shit, but I've been procrastinating. She have been too. We both been procrastinating. She been procrastinating, and I've been procrastinating, and we're some procrastinators. But we gonna stop though. We gonna get active. We gonna lock in, and we gonna and we gonna we gonna do that shit. But y'all subscribe to my YouTube channel, okay? In the video. Give me a kiss. In it. Give me a kiss, baby. Give me a kiss first. I don't wanna <laughs> Put my toe in your mouth. I dare you to put my toe in your mouth. How much? <laughs> it's a dare. So you gotta do it. Put some cha ching on the end of that dare and I'm like. I give you a dollar. Do I like a fucking skank to you? <laughs> Shut up. No dollar. Okay, five dollars. Up that price, Shotty. Cause them some fucking creepy crawlies. You gonna lie? Up that damn price, Shotty. Ten dollars. You not gonna put my toe in your mouth for ten dollars? Up it. She said, it's cap. Nigga, stop lying. Up the price. Twenty. Take them off. He gonna do it for $20. Take him off. Hey. Open your mouth. <laughs> Y'all, he's lying. He's lying. No, I can't do it. You not doing it for $20? Nah. For them? Nah. To get out the ground and lick that shit. Shoot the dare. Yeah. Nigga, you you just ain't do the dare. I just did. Oh no, nah. I gotta sit. I thought, damn, shoot the dare. Dare. I dare you to go jump on that truck. Jump on the truck. Like jump on the back of it and on make the... it bounce in the back. Alright. You say nothing but words. Recording. These motherfuckers walking all casual. Like she, I told her to make the fucking truck shake. Bottom. Wow. She was literally just twerking just now. You see me shake my ass? Look at that. True. Oh, she better me your ass. Give me, give me you want me to ask this to the best of my ability or straight truth? Truth! The honest truth. Ask me that again. Who's pussy better? Me or your ex? <laughs> um... <laughs> Bro, answer the question. You have five seconds. Oh, who? Yours. Who? Yours. Oh, okay. How many bodies you got? <laughs> I'm gonna drink. You gonna drink to that one? What the fuck? Nigga, I asked you how many bodies I'm you got. I'm gonna drink. I didn't even pick two. I'm not answering that question. You want me to answer that for real for me? Yeah, I'm I don't not answering that question. People don't need to know that. They don't need to know that.